Assalamu alaikum dear students today is our 7th lecture and it is related from book page number 8 in lecture number 6 we started the topic the two nation theory evolution muslim league and two nation theory and today we will continue it before starting the explanation or main points of page number 8 first we recap the lecture number 6 main points the evolution of two nation theory sir sayyid ahmed khan was a great muslim leader first muslim leader initially he was in favor of hindu muslim unity but later events changed his mind the events were urdu hindi controversy in 1867 the hindus of banaras started the movement against urdu formation of all indian national congress first political party in the subcontinent or british india but it was dominated by hindus and policies were against the muslims partition of bengal 1905 bengal was a largest province and it was divided on administrative ground by the britishers which was the happier movement for the muslims but was not acceptable by the congress or hindus shimla deputation 35 muslim leaders went to shimla and they demanded a separate electorates for the muslims in legislative council it was also not acceptable for the hindus these events we can say also the base for the formation of other political party and that political party was all india muslim league it was formed on 30th december 1906 in muhammadan educational conference at dhaka by sir salimullah khan for your information i want to clear some points about muhammadan educational conference this conference was set up by sir sayyad ahmed khan in 1886 for the educational development of the muslims in this conference sir salimullah khan put the foundation of separate muslim political party Muslim League The objective of this party was to promote good friendly relations between Muslims and Hindus and also Britishers to protect the political and other rights of the Muslims This party struggled for the protection of the interest of the Indian Muslims in the idea yeah under the idea of two nation theory in 1906 to 1928 but in 1928 the struggle was changed two nation theory to two separate states and what is the reason behind the demand nehru report in 1928 the all parties conference was called for making the unanimous constitution for subcontinent or british india and for this purpose a committee was formed in which the hindu or congress leaders were in majority and head of this committee was moti lal nehru a congress leader he presented the report which is known as nehru report and the recommendations of this report were totally against the interest of the hindus and muslims so this report eliminated the possibility of hindu muslim unity forever yani is report ke present hone se jo ke do mukammal keh le ya totally keh le musalmano ke against thi to isne hindu muslim ittehad ke liye jo baat ki ja rahi thi 1928 se wo idea ya wo सोच तब्दील हो गई एक सेपरेट कंट्री की तरफ और वो कैसे हुई इट वॉज इम्पॉर्टेंट जंक्चर और इम्पॉर्टेंट टर्न हेयर कायद अजम सेट दिस इज द पार्टिंग ऑफ द वेज यानी यहाँ से हमारे रास्ते जुदा जुदा हैं आफ्टर नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी एट्स नेहरू रिपोर्ट इन नाइनटीन थर्टी सेवन इलेक्शंस एलेवन प्रोवेंशल assemblies took or participate in these elections these elections were held february to march in 11 provinces 
Congress got majority in eight provinces, and they started their ruling time. At that time, they behave or treat the Muslims very badly, and they started the brutal treatment with the Muslims. At that time, nineteen thirty nine World War Two was started, and Britishers want the assistance from all major parties. On the behalf of the help, Congress gave some point to accept the condition or points. Then we will ready to join the Britishers in the war. But Viceroy rejected this demands for to pressurize the British government. Congress resigned the provincial ministries. क्लियर यहाँ पे जो कांग्रेस ने अपनी डिमांड्स और कंडीशंस रखी थी कि हमारे ये मुतालबात माने जाएं तो हम आपके साथ दूसरी जंग अजीम में शिरकत करेंगे आपका साथ देंगे लेकिन वाइस नहीं मानता यहाँ पे एंड टू प्रेशराइज द ब्रिटिशर्स कांग्रेस रिजाइन फ्रॉम द प्रोवेंशल मिनिस्ट्रीज और दिस रेजिग्नेशन फ्राम द प्रोवेंशल मिनिस्ट्रीज वर दैपियर मूवमेंट फॉर द मुस्लिम्स and the muslim league and muslim celebrated this day the day of deliverance 22nd december 1939 so the 1937 elections were also the event which made the possibility of the creation of pakistan clear for more clearance you must give the thorough reading to page number 6 7 and 8 the two short question answers also related questions related to these topics why was the need felt for the formation of muslim league how did the nehru report affect the political thinking of the muslims short question numbers 5 or 6 also related these two topics number 3 long question is elucidate the evolution of the ideology of pakistan yani wazia kare ki pakistan ki ideology ka irtika ya ibtida kaise hui so these three questions related to the lecture number 6 or 7 so must read it thank you